hi welcome to my channel my name is Shibin today in this video we will discuss about uh, decticizing for uh, doing decticizing we need a software first this software is MC query uh, decticizing tool I will upload this uh, software along with this video under the description you will find uh, download link so we will start one by one how we will uh, do uh, decticizing there is two method is there uh, to calculate uh, decticizing one is uh, uh, you know velo equal velocity system and equal friction loss uh, system so we will uh, normally all the engineering consultant they will do for uh, equal uh, friction loss uh, method in this method we will uh, we have one uh, in a drawing right now here in this drawing there is two outlet is there one is here in this point you can see over here i will zoom in this one uh, outlet is there here the cfm is 260 cfm and the one more outlet is here it is 440 cfm the total it will be uh, for, uh, 440 plus 260 is equal to 700 cfm this 700 cfm we need to enter in our uh, drawing first because uh, th that meaning the 700 uh, cfm will start from this machine so this that <coughs> sorry this duct will uh, take 700 CFM uh, air and there is a branch is there and one straight duct is going over here so we will open our software here we need to change our unit because this is a liter per second we need to go to uh, another unit here we will enter 700 CFM here 700 CFM and we will go back again uh, to liter per second because we do uh, it is equal to 700 uh, CFM is equal to 330 liter per second uh, the um, ratio is 2.1 uh, you know this multiply this 2.1 uh, it will go to CFM then head loss I, as I told you before there is two methodology is there we will go through equal friction loss here you mean, uh, you put it uh, 0.5 this is the friction loss for the GA duct okay then again we need to enter some values here the first duct size here the first duct size is uh, showing 470 into 250 this is why because there is internal lining is there you know um, um, sound absorber uh, lining is there um, ok that's where reason 25 mm 25 mm extra all surrounding they will add it so actual duct size is 450 by 225 ok this one then how we will find it we will see we need to enter first value this uh, second value we keep it as a zero first value we need to enter for example uh, 450 not 150 450 then automatically the second value will come over here okay if uh, i am resizing the duct for example uh, this size i need um, you know four four uh, fifty means this is bottom right bottom uh, portion if I want bottom uh, more flat, then I am going for uh, you know 500. Then the height of the duct means the width of the duct uh, 200 mm is enough. If I want to make it uh, almost uh, you know square type, so I will make uh, 250, no, 250, 300. You try to 300, 300 by 325 or uh, 300 by 300 also you can install this duct. This first portion. Then uh, here we taken a branch this branch duct size what should be well, for the branch we have 260 cfm is there so we will go to cfm we will change here uh, 260 cfm and uh, we will come back to this uh, unit again because uh, 260 cfm is equal to 123 liter per second uh, here keep it as it is no problem uh, this portion we will change the size here 275 is there the first and the second is 200 is there here you can see so we will enter as it is like uh, 275 by 200 is coming okay if I am putting uh, 250 is, is equal 250 into 175 is coming that also because 25 mm difference is there okay. here it is 250 here 275 here 175 here two, uh, 200 that means there is a lining is there internal lining is there and when you uh, come down to this portion last portion they again uh, reduce the size 275 by 150 okay because there is a branch already taken that's why this portion they have make it 
down. So, this is the way you need to find out the deck sizing. Here, we will calculate one more size. Uh, here, the CFM is uh, four, 440 CFM. So, here we will mention again uh, 440 CFM, 440. Again, we will go back to the old uh, unit. 440 CFM is equal to 208 liter per second. Here, 0 0.49 or 0 0.5, there is no problem. Uh, here we will mention this deck to size. So, you can uh, decide your deck to size, what is comfortable as per your site, you can uh, put that deck to size. Here uh, maybe there is a lining is there, that is why they put it 25 mm extra. Here I will ma mention the 400 mm. So, the another size is 175 only required, here it is mentioned the 200, that means there is a lining is there, 25 mm lining is there inside. That is why reason there is uh, they are putting 200. Okay. So, this is very simple uh, methodology to find out uh, uh, duct sizing. Uh, all duct you can uh, do like this. Okay. If th there is some uh, high pressure duct, then uh, scenario will be little different. Normal uh, duct you can uh, uh, do in this uh, way. And uh, also, I will give you some other tips also. Here you can see in this um, software, uh, there is a um, velocity is there. Okay. Velocity should not increase more than uh, 5 meter per second. If it is more than 5 meters per second, there is you know too much uh, sound will be there, noise will be there inside the deck. It should be for the um, you know accommodation area like you know um, uh, bedroom or any other um, you know, occupied area, the deck uh, velocity should be less than uh, 5 meter per second. This is uh, comfortable. Some people they will do you know shaft area and all other areas they will make it you know 8 meter per second or 6 meter per second ok that we can do in uh, external area. But in, in the building inside if the uh, human is passing and the people are there means they need you know silent uh, room uh, comfort. In that case we need to mention uh, you need to stick with you know less than 5 meter per second. Here it is 3.03 it is ok there is no issues. Okay, this is the methodology to uh, uh, find out a uh, deck sizing, and uh, in our next video we will uh, discuss about more uh, HVAC. If you like my channel, you can subscribe us uh, so that you can uh, earn and you can click this bell button so that you will uh, get uh, my uh, further videos. And uh, I will put, um, I will try to post this uh, software below my uh, video link so that you can uh, able to download and you can implement at your project and you can. Uh, do your own exercise. Thank you so much for watching my video. Thank you. Bye-bye.